Yeah, it was. I was really proud of the way the starters came out and, and set the tone, uh, especially in the, starting the third quarter. And that's usually been our Achilles heel, but came out, set the tone defensively, and, and built a 30-plus uh, lead. So uh, yeah, my hat's off to the, those guys. I know you talk about defense winning championships and how important it is, but your offense is operating at such efficiency. How do you explain that besides just well, making shots? Well, again, we've got some, we got a tacker in Kyle Lowry who can also shoot the three. Um, you know, and that's not even including when you get Patrick out there and, and, and Sully when he comes in at the four. Uh, you've got a dynamic center in the po low post that can score in the low post, offensive boards, uh, a willing passer with, with Lucas. So you got some good pieces that fit. They know what each other are, the continuity from over the years, playing with each other, knowing each other, all that stuff adds together, and playing with a tremendous amount of confidence on the offensive end. Again, you were not going to become defensive juggernauts overnight, but the way we played in the third quarter has got to be the, our disposition. At least make people feel us, um, and um, uh, that's the way we, we got to play on both. And if we're playing for something big, if we're just going through the motions trying to win 50 games, cool. But if we want to do something important, we've got to make sure we play like we did the third quarter. Rebounding has been an issue for you guys. It's now been three games in a row where you've uh, rebounded mm -hmm. your opponent. Um, what's been the biggest difference you've noticed? Well, one is Lucas and, and JV in there together. There's no excuse for those two not to, to dominate two seven-footers in there. Uh, and they did tonight today. They did a good job of rebounding today. And that's going to be something that I think when Sully comes in, he will help us on the boards more than anything else taking up space. Um, but again, I think the difference, Josh, is Lucas and also JB together has helped us tremendously. And our guards have come back and did a better job of sandwiching, getting into people's body, especially a dynamic rebounder like Noah, who's a handful and there's one of the top offensive rebounders in the league. Dwayne, I mean, you look at the way you guys performed on this home stand, what do you take out of it that's positive and, and how does this set you up for what Doug said is, is, is our, what's positive about it is our offensive efficiency. With the way we can score, the different methods we can score, different ways, whether it's fast, slow down, uh, is important. I thought we've shown glimpses of defensive stands, um, and that's been impressive in like a third quarter tonight. Uh, again, we've got, and I just got on the bench for coming in and not being mentally. Uh, ready to play, and usually they come in and, and pour it on. But today, for Dave, for some reason, we weren't ready. So everybody's got to be locked in. We our margin for error is not there, and so we've got to be locked in from top to bottom. We you know to step in, the guy's got to do his job. So, uh, but the offensive efficiency has been important. Better about where you are now versus when you came home off the road. Uh, a little bit, you know. Again, you, when you win, you, everybody feels good. And I don't know if it's false security, or whatever. We'll find out on this this road trip. It's going to be hard um, at Brooklyn, at at um, uh, Philadelphia, who's playing well right now, and Charlotte. So if we don't go in with our high beams on and play like we did in the third quarter, um, is is our challenge. And again, we don't want to stay the same, Michael. We got to continue to work to get better, and not just be happy of getting stacking up wins. Having Lucas beside him and not being kind of on the, on the it's huge, uh, Eric, and the fact that you know he had he can you know he's going to take two guys with him to help box him out. Now the ball is free to, for Lucas to go get it, uh, and that's going to be that's really important. Whether it's Patrick in there, Sully in there, another big dynamic, strong body to go get the ball, and uh, rebounding is going to be huge for us, if especially. There was a few times in the first half we got stops, but we couldn't come up with the rebound. So uh, it's going to be important, and it really helps Jonas a lot to, to have that second rebounder in there with him. Looking at, looking at the big picture, how, how important is it to not have to play tomorrow for two straight four quarters and having to rest yourself? It's huge. It's, and to cut down his minutes, cut down on Kyle's minutes is important. Um, to have those guys, you know, the. You don't see it all at once, but as, as the year goes on, the movements gets a little slower. So we want to make sure we watch our minutes. And again, when you play that way and get leads, you, you can get rest, you know, and that's, that's very important.